Do you think that morality is created or discovered? Discovered. So, you're of the opinion that morality is objective and human beings discover what it is and we conform to it? Yeah. Where does it come from? What, morality? Yeah. So having moral, morals, it comes from... Because I mean, if it's discovered, and that means it originated somewhere, and then we discover it. Where do you think it comes from? No, he, no, he's actually right. So yeah, no, you're right. It's created, then yeah. It's created. Yeah, then it would be, yeah, it's created. Yeah. All right. Can I can I ask you a follow up to that? Um, because it was created by law by men. Yeah, I was just about to ask you. Who do you think created? Okay, you, you, you. You read my mind. Okay, so you think it was created by man? Yeah. Okay, do you think that it's created by family, culture, yeah. country, yeah. history, group? Which one? I would, or I would, I would all? say that definitely has like a lot of aspects towards it. Okay, let me ask you this, this last one about what you just said. Because mm -hmm. in philosophy... We, when we speak about morality being subjective, meaning it was created, then we end up with this absurd statement. What I want to do is what I ought to do, and what I ought to do is what I want to do. One person can say that, or a group of people can say that. What I ought to do is what I want to do, and what I want to do is what I ought to do. So we essentially make ourselves the standard, or a group makes themselves the standard. And what they want to do is simply what they're obligated to do. And what they're obligated to do is what they want to do. So the absurdity is to follow yourself. How do you escape that? How do you escape that? That's magic. How would you expect? <laughs> I wouldn't. Mom! How would you escape that? She heard me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. my mom's listening as well. Oh. How many of you are listening? Mom. Free. Oh, okay. Yeah, how would you escape that, what he just said? Um, say the last bit again. Um, I left the room. Sorry, say the last bit again. Okay, so. Whenever someone says that morality is subjective, which means that we think it was created by a group of people, then we end up with this absurd statement. What I ought to do is what I want to do. And what I want to do is what I ought to do. A simpler way of saying it is, what I'm obligated to do is what I want to do. And what I want to do is what I'm obligated to do. Which means that we're simply following ourselves at the end of the day. How do you escape the absurdity of following yourself? Your, your um, religion, I would say religion would come into it and you follow a religious order. I think I heard the word religion. Morality. What, what did you say oh, about I religion? Say, I said rather than follow yourself, you would follow a religious order. Yeah, you have to follow an order that you that you um agree with. Like you, God, right? Yeah. That's so, there. It is. That's the, that's the escape. That's how you escape it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, your yeah. your mother is very smart. She escape. She that's the answer. That's the answer. When you when you have God, when God it's is like the philosophy. standard. It's philosophy, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it is. Yeah. But when, my sister studied. Hey, when God is the standard, you escape the absurdity of following yourself. Right. What year do you teach? What year do I teach? Yeah, like as in like, uh, what grade? Well, actually, I teach in a church. I'm a teacher right. in a church. I'm up here smoking, you know. <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna condemn you. I'm, I'm not God. 
Yeah, he's very nice. You're a very lovely person. Thank you. I liked your question. It was very, very intelligent. Yeah, it's better than seeing all of these weirdos on here that are doing all the like, oh, sexual actually, stuff. Oh, that's bad. Stop asking him that because it's going to frustrate my soul. Yeah, so your mom, your mom answered the question correctly. She is very smart. What what religion is is your mom, if she doesn't mind me asking? Hey, mommy. Um, well, my, my, uh, uh, hi. <laughs> she, put me, she put me on this thing. Um, my family's Roman Catholic. Okay. Okay, okay. Yeah, so I've you been, believe I've you believe the, the God of the Bible then, the, the biblical God? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm Presbyterian. I'm Christian as well. And that's the correct answer to these questions. If you have God, then you have a standard for morality that's outside of yourself. And you escape the absurdity of following yourself. And the reason why it's absurd to follow yourself is because you're not perfect. Which means that your moral code that you create for yourself is going to be imperfect and just based upon yourself and can change at any time, at any moment, depending on the circumstances. <laughs> true, true. Right, right. Yeah. Thank you for your time. And no uh, tell your daughters thank you for their time as well and for being so nice. Thank you. It's all right. Have a good day. Same. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Thank Bye. You. Bye. Bye.